Hello, hello, my beautiful, wonderful people. This is your girl, Jazzy Jazz with Timeless and Creative Self. And today I am working on, I've, I've been wanting to do, I think it's pronounced diptych or dip, diptych. Yeah, I think it's called a diptych, diptych, which is a two panel um, painting or fluid art painting. And um, there's a couple state parks, Washington Oaks Parks, uh, beaches that I've been to here and I was actually very inspired to do sort of like an aerial view of the ocean and the beach um, and so I'm gonna try to do that today with fluid art and I've got a few colors that I've already mixed um, I have a cobalt blue hue that I'll be using for part of the ocean a greenish blue that I created using Thalo blue, thalo green, um, cobalt blue, and I'm missing a color. I'm missing a color because this just, it came out stunning. So this is going to be the darker part of the water. Um, I mixed a turquoise, which will be more towards the front. I have white, of course, and then I have the sand. And the sand here is not, it's not white sand. It is a beautiful, beautiful, like brown shimmery type of sand and so that's why you see how these corners are a little bit more brown than than you would see in, in the sand so i mean i'm just gonna try this out i'm gonna see i'm gonna see how this goes i'm hoping that we'll you know i'll get the effect that i wanted um once i have all the colors kind of poured down i will be coming in with the blow dryer and blowing out the ocean part um and depending on how the sand comes out, maybe the sand as well, but the sand was supposed to be more, uh, kind of look more like the base. It will have a darker sand right next to where the water would be and then lighter sand towards the end. So yeah, we're gonna try this out. And um, I, I always liked like trying to depict things with fluid art, so I wanna try this. And so, we're naming this Calm Coast. <laughs> all right, so I hope you all enjoy. I'm just gonna get some white ready for me. And then we will get started. Oh, and I forgot to mention that I have um, some metallic colors actually, and I'm really excited. I ordered some PBO acrylics, and these are the metallic um, and the Dyna. So this is a iridescent blue green, and this is an iridescent precious gold that I will be using to kind of give these colors a metallic pop. Okay, so I'm very excited because I've never used PBO, PBO before. I think it's PBO or PBO. I'm not sure. So we'll see how it goes. Without further ado, let's get started. <laughs> 